This is an elliptical chuck, and the way it works is you loosen the bolts back here, and you turn this knob, and what it does, it offsets this to one side, and then the center, centerpiece will oscillate in oval, uh, oval movement. I took the plate off, I turned down a taper on this back spud, okay, it was 90 degrees, I, I turned a taper, and the reason why uh, is because I want the screws to basically pull this, uh, this face plate against the chuck. Okay, and that taper will allow the, that pulling action. Okay, and I also turn down the screw heads with a radius to try to minimize any type of movement. All right, I don't know if you can see that. Let me get focused here. All right, here we go. That is about two and a half tenths. I'm getting about four to five tenths. I'm wondering if that has something to do with the finish inside that hole. All right, here it is. Simple, straightforward. It's not sexy, it doesn't have a uh, oval chuck, double eccentric, worm gear, but it is precise, it's rigid. It's exactly what I need for watch dials and knife handles.